uh, we spoke with Zia Modi of uh, AZB Partners. She says she's happy with the HDFC Max deal uh, that went through, but she says she doesn't expect uh, any more major consolidation in the insurance space uh, itself. But however, she says that the bankruptcy legislation, insolvency legislation should be the game changer of the country. Here's a slice of a very interesting conversation. Upcoming in the next six months to one year, do you expect more large-scale merger to the tune of HDFC Max or, for instance, Aditya Birla, Grasim and Finance? Well, we didn't do the Aditya Birla one, but we did do the Max one. I think there will still be some mega deals out there, but not as many as I would like. Uh, but definitely, when there's a Max HDFC stand life type of thing, it's a one-in-a-lifetime deal. Uh, people will want to look at that tripartite combination again. Um, but I think deals will not be so big so soon. Hmm. What about the insurance space? Do you expect more consolidation? Insurance space almost played out. Very few are left. No Most more of them have gone to 49. Um, I'm not sure there'll be significant consolidation because everything's looking valuable now. Hmm. You know, after the Max and HDFC deal, there were a lot of questions about the non compete. How, how, what would you justify or what would you tell the minority shareholders on the non-compete fee aspect? Well, we were for Analjit Singh, so I'm mm -hmm. not commenting on the non-compete. Comment I'm glad it got passed. <laughs> okay, fair enough. IPO pipeline, do you expect it to pick up even more now? There's enough money to subscribe. Depends on how attractive it is. You look at RBL, Ratnakar Bank, it got wiped, it got picked up 66 times. You look at others. So it depends on the quality of the asset. Mm -hmm. Um, but I think there's appetite. Oh, yes, that depends on uh, quality of issues and pricing. Uh, 